Hi Snapshot Tech Tips. I forgot my Windows login passwords. Please help. Press and hold down the shift key. And then immediately click on restart. Okay, you can release the shift key now. Click on troubleshoot and then next. Click on advanced options. Click on command prompt. In the command prompt window, you type regedit. It will take you into the registry editor. I don't like to rename things. Can you show me the best way to reset Windows passwords? No problem, you click on each key local machine and highlight it, then you move your mouse cursor to file and scroll down to select load hive. Once you in the load hive mode, then you click on this PC icon on the left hand side, it will take you in the devices and drives. What you want is the bootable Windows drive, in this case will not be the C drive as usually the case. You have to make a smart decision. In this case we have two local disk drives so you have to select the biggest storage, because the F local disk drive is not enough space for Windows operating system. So you select the local disk E drive. It will take you into Windows directory then you look for system32 folder, you click on it. Then you search for the config folder. Inside the config folder you will see a SAM file. You click on it. A load hive window will pop up. You then type hack as a key name. Then click on OK to accept. It will take you back to the registry editor window, you navigate to the H key local machine then you will see a hack folder. You open it, navigate to SAM folder. Next is the domains folder, next is an account folder next the users folder. You just need to focus on 000001F4 folder. Because it is a built-in administrator account, On the right hand side, you select the F file. So you can go to edit binary value. In the value data which is row number 8. You want to replace 11 to 10. Make sure highlight number 11 then on your keyboard, press down on Dell key to delete it then you type 10. Then you click on OK to exit. If you want to take a photo of your edit binary value if you want, it will never the same binary value if you reset built an administrator account again. This is a tutorial video please do not hack on other people computer, and make a good use of it. Then click OK to accept the changes. Don't celebrate too early, you must click on the hack folder, then move your mouse cursor to the file and then scroll down to select unload hive, if you don't click on unload hive and then it won't work. It is an important message to take. Click on yes button to confirm the unload hive is good to go. Select file and scroll down to select exit. In the command prompt window. Then you type exit. Click on troubleshoot and then next. Click on advanced options. You click on startup settings. And then on click on restart button. Then press F4 key on your keyboard to enable safe mode. The built-in administrator doesn't have a password, if you click on it, it will log in automatically. Once you are in the Windows operating system, in the search bar, you can type NETPLWIZ and hit enter. Then the user accounts window is being displayed. You can select a username to reset password. If there is a problem and you want to learn more, you can watch one of my tutorial videos how to create or delete a local account in Windows via CMD. Now everything is under controlled, you may go ahead to turn off the built-in administrator account via CMD to ensure your PC is being safe. Open the command prompt window run as administrator. Then you type net user administrator space slash active no. Then hit enter. Then type exit.